I've had some questions from shareholders that might be new to investing in, in graphite. Um, and I wanted to help them understand the metallurgy of our graphite deposits and the difference between sugarloaf and lachroma and how key the metallurgy is to unlocking the value in any potential graphite project. So when we're talking about metallurgy, we're talking about the process that happens after the ore is dug up. It's the processing that you take it through to turn it into a saleable product. And there are a number of important things to consider. When we define a graphite resource, one of the elements we have to prove is that we've got reasonable prospects for economic extraction. And the only way you can show that is to make sure that your metallurgy works and you can concentrate it to a high grade concentrate and then have that as a saleable product or turn it into spherical graphite. If you can't get the metallurgy to work, then you can't define a resource. That's part of the Jort code. So unlike a, a gold resource or say an iron ore resource where the metallurgical practices and principles are quite well established, uh, it can be quite variable across a graphite resource. So you need to do more metallurgical test work and make sure each domain can go through that process. So when we talk about the metallurgy at Sugarloaf versus Lachroma, because the metallurgy at Sugarloaf has not been established yet, We've, we've done the first stage of collecting sample to undertake that test work, but we don't yet have the confidence to do a resource drill out because we need to show that that metallurgy will work before we invest that kind of money in doing the resource drilling. Yet here at Lachroma, we've got a very good understanding of at least the first stages of the metallurgy. We are able to produce a high quality, um, high grade concentrate with good recoveries. So we now have the confidence to do the resource drill out at Lachroma. And that shows by we're drilling in excess of 95 holes here at Lachroma, whereas at Sugarloaf, we drilled just 17 holes to collect that sample for metallurgy. So the metallurgy of the deposit is the key to unlocking the value and the potential of that deposit. So I hope you found those explanations really helpful. Um, if you would like to stay up to date with more information that we put out regularly, please join up to our socials or join up on our email list at uh, www.itechminerals.com.au Thanks for listening.